person who wants to have a child. That side only. If you want to have a child, that side, run forward. Stop there. You're a visitor from where? Eh? Bring that sister also of yellow jacket. Yes. That other people must go and sit down. Only two. Let's start by two. You want a child also? Yes. You're from where? I'm from Pumalanka, Whitbank. Are you married? Yes, I am. Where's your husband? He's there. Let's bring him. Yourself, where's the husband? Let's bring all the husbands too. In the issue of you, here, you are my visitor. But I will tell you, this issue of what the family say, don't take it. You hear me, my brother? Yes. Eh? yes. Don't take what the family say. You can't marry another person. This one is your wife. Amen. And God will honor you. Are you hearing me? Amen. Don't listen to people. The child is coming. Amen. Receive your baby boy. Yes, sir. Receive your baby boy. Amen. Receive your baby boy. Take In the name of Jesus Christ. What kind of baby do you want, my sister? Twins. Twins. Boy and a girl. Eh? A boy and a girl. I receive only a boy. <laughs> Don't receive three. Receive a boy. Go and sit down. You will have a child. Brother. My name is Purpero Doboro. I come from Flefontaine. Limpopo province, South Africa, I came here with my husband. The main problem was uh, failing to conceive. Yes. It's frustrating, to be honest. We've been married for two years, and yeah, it's been hard. It uh, affected me in a bad way because if you see marriages and uh, you find that they've got children, you don't have a children. And uh, I was having a problem, a lot of problem, even at work. I found people discussing about having children and I know that in our marriage we don't have a children. It was affecting me badly. Yes. No, it, we didn't have problems such because we used to support each other. Your um, biggest fan of Char Charis TV. I'm always watching people deliver and their problems solved. So I would sit down and discuss that we have to book one-on-one -on -one and see the man of God and we know that our problem will be solved. Yeah, I said many problems that some of them I didn't know, but I know that I was having a problem and I needed deliverance. And I can see that he truly is a man of God. Just to look at him, you can feel the presence of God in him. And it, that was so wonderful. It was amazing. Um, the good thing is the man of God also prophesied that we are going to have a baby boy so that that's really good yes the men of god were called those who wanted the children to run forward and i had to take that chance and run forward <laughs> yes <laughs> i always wanted twins so <laughs> when he asked uh, for me what i needed i just mentioned twins a boy and a girl but he, he said uh, i see a boy and that is also good a child is a blessing from god so if it's god's will i accept that one I am happy that all my problems, all the problems that brought us to this place are solved. Uh, what I can say to them is that God's time is the best. And to seek help uh, through deliverance by uh, men of God all over. They don't have to sit down and do nothing about it. Yeah, they can take a step and, and seek help. Uh, there are men of God all over who are always willing to, to help out. I have seen God in this place, so they can just do the same. Uh, the encouragement that I can give other men out there is when they meet a problem like this, they have to stand for each other, support each other, because uh, children come from God. And uh, I believe that God's time is the best. Yeah, we please seek the face of God and uh, know what God will say about the situation. Don't divorce your wife. Love your wife and support her all the time. Amen.